Joe, a, a big three points there. You must be pleased with that. Yeah, it's a um, great start to the to the new year. Um, I thought we first half we were the dominant of the two sides. I think we should be probably pushing to go ahead um, before the before the half time. Um, but now I think on the balance of things we probably deserve the three points today um, to keep a clean sheet and obviously grabs took in the penalty away um, it's a it's a good start yeah nice to extend that that unbeaten run and get a win to, to add to that run as well yeah look there's been a lot of doom and gloom um, on on social media and the fans five unbeaten another clean sheet um, grab and scored again so you can't really complain to come away from home. Um, a tough place to come, Preston, we know that. They make it difficult, but on the balance of things, we've scored, kept a clean sheet, and um, three points, which was much needed. And right at the end, the team had to dig in and, and cling on to that clean sheet. That must be really pleasing for you. Yeah, um, over the moon, I think. It's not really a sense of relief in the changing room after, but we're, we're, we're happy. We've, we've come to... Uh, um, to Preston today with with a with a game plan to not let them have too many chances, which I don't think we did in the first half. In the second half, later on in the game, I thought we were maybe a little bit naive, didn't play um, as sensibly as we could in the last 10, 15 minutes of the game. But um, I think we need to retain it better up top, up the top of the pitch. I think um, a couple of times we we're a little bit naive, dribbling inside when we could probably keep it in the corner flags and be a bit more streetwise I suppose but again we didn't concede and we scored so happy days yeah, and when Lewis got that penalty were you, were you confident he'd stick it away yeah he's um, I know his his conversion rate hasn't been unbelievable for Forrest from the spot but look I've a lot of faith in grabs um, I know he he takes some sticks sometimes but his, his goal record at this level's second to none so um, he saved us again today and um, and big mention to Brees as well in goal I think he's took a bit of flack um, from me and from the, the fans of late but we know what Brees can do and he's made two or three massive um, saves for us today so props to him Yeah, to have someone like, like Brees to call upon when there's a shot that's going in the corner and he flings across and tips around the post to have someone like that behind you must be really reassuring. Yeah, there's nobody I'd rather have in this league behind me. Um, I think he's, he's fantastic. He's uh, very laid back and he's, uh, he plays with swagger at times, but with his feet um, and some of the saves he made today from the Gallagher free kick, the cross that came in, the bravery. Um, and again, he's not scared to come and claim or punch crosses. And I think um, he deserves a lot of credit for, for the win today. And it's a win, plenty of positives to build on. And you know, we're going to the cup next week, but you know, to, to kickstart the new year in that way is fantastic, isn't it? Yeah, look, you can't complain. Like I said, um, the last four games, to, we've, we've drawn three, what is it, two or three clean sheets. And um, I think it's promotion form, isn't it? Almost. Um, but now I think without getting carried away with we're not in the bottom three anymore last night with um, Sheffield Wednesday picking up the points um, against Derby I know I'd rather want I'd, I want Sheffield Wednesday to win that game but the, but at the same time it puts us in the bottom three so um, on the balance of things we wanted a draw but we've come today and, and, and got the win um, haven't, con haven't conceded and Grabs has took one in for us, so um, it'll be a happy bus home um, today, I'm sure.